One of the things that I haven't been crazy about about my RX-8 is this plastic around my exhaust. So as you can see over here, really nice and dark, and then over here, just this really kind of light color. But I got some other issues going on. Um, this back bumper was re-sprayed. So you can see here, I have some like leftover paint and some drippings. So I'm gonna try and remove this off of there. And then today we're gonna be applying uh, Cerakote. I haven't used this. I've obviously used black um, on my tires, which is the one year tire protection. And you can actually put that on plastic pieces as well. However, I've heard really good things about Cerakote and I wanna give it a try. It's really just these large wipes that you just kind of apply on there. And uh, I've heard really good things. I've seen really good reviews. So we're gonna go ahead and try and remove some of this paint off of here. I'm gonna use some isopurple alcohol and then uh, try some different things. But you have to be careful with like acetone, things like that, because it can actually melt this plastic. So that's what it looks like. It kind of made it a little bit darker. I don't think it burned into the plastic. Isopurple alcohol is not supposed to do that. I think acetone will do that. But um, it did remove most of the paint. Um, there's still just a couple spots. I really don't want to use anything more aggressive. I know you can use like a compound, so maybe I'll try a compound and whatnot. But um, you know, it looks a lot better and it removed a lot of that off of there, at least from what I can tell. Um, but uh, yeah, I'll see if I play around this a little bit more but I really just never liked that look. I'm probably the only one that's noticed it. Um, but uh, yeah, I mean, aside from it being darker, which I do want to get it darker, um, I think it'll be fine. There's just a couple little small spots where um, that's still on there, but uh, I'll decide if I play around with it a little bit more, but I think I'm gonna probably move on to applying the Cerakote. Okay, so it says do not apply in direct sunlight and I'm not in direct sunlight here. Um, the sun's going down over there, so we should be good. Pre-moistened applicators make it easy to apply uh, Cerakote trim coat uh, than standard dressing products. Then yeah, let's see. One coat lasts up to 200 washers or more guaranteed. So that's a pretty uh, pretty bold claim. So essentially wash surface thoroughly using non-wax detergent, dry surface, um, then apply using protective gloves, um, wipe and overlapping passes. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna give it a go. Let's try it out, 200 washes. I don't know. you can see it pretty good uh, this stuff actually is pretty impressive um, I didn't do the center section because for whatever reason this plastic is always like dark and any RX-8 that you see this is always like super super light in terms of discoloration so I don't know what it is if it's heat from the exhaust or what they use on this but at the end of the day these two plastic two plastics are not similar or something weird happens with the exhaust of why it turns a different color but at the end of the day 
Does it match perfectly? No, but it looks so much better. I've used other products on this. And as you guys can see, it looks a lot better. You know, there's some spots that are a little bit lighter, a little bit darker. I went over them again, um, but that is as good as I can get them. Hopefully you guys have used this before and liked it. If you haven't, I think this was about 17 bucks on Amazon and they give you a huge pack here. They give you 10 large extra wipes. I used two, actually I used three and there were more than enough. I really didn't even need to use three. I just needed to use two, but I'll leave a link in my description below. If you guys have used Cerakote, leave me a comment below. I'd love to get you guys' thoughts on it. Uh, but overall, I really liked it. This turned out really well. We'll see if it holds up to the 200 washes. I'm Austin. This is Gone in 60 Detailing. Thanks for watching. Catch you on the next video.